Alright guys, welcome to the video, my name is Kyle Richardson, today I'm going to be vlogging again, you may have seen my video yesterday, um, yeah, kind of went to flop a bit, wasn't the most interesting video, I'm not going to lie, but uh, yeah, so I'm just getting ready for the gym now, I've just finished up editing um, the video that you're going to see before this, so yesterday's video, the one I recorded yesterday. But yeah, just getting ready for the gym now. I'm going with Jack again. We're going to be hitting chest and triceps uh, with a little bit of shoulders. And typically before I go to the gym, I just sort of chill out in my room, um, watch a few YouTube videos, a few gym videos, getting an idea of what I want to be training and how, and what sort of exercises I want to be doing on the day um, to best benefit me for like what I'm sort of tailoring towards like my goals um, and I just listened to some music and that just to get a bit pumped up sort my headphones out and make sure they're charged today I'm going to be using uh, the wireless beats that I've had quite a while uh, yeah and then after we're going to be doing cardio uh, we'll probably go in the sauna and steam room again and then I think we might go and play a little bit of golf uh, yeah so typically in my gym bag I just take now, I'm going to be taking my camera with me, I'll have my headphones, I'll have a water bottle that I've got to fill up. Um, usually I've got a hat, this is the one I wore in yesterday's video, but I've got so many hats, I'll probably just pick a different one to go with this outfit, because I'm going to be wearing shorts today, because it's quite hot, it's quite humid, the air's really thick, so um, yeah, and obviously I feel a bit more comfortable doing cardio in shorts. Uh, so yeah, I'll just take this little rucksack, this Jack Wheels rucksack that I got off my girlfriend's um, mum and dad for my birthday. Uh, yes, a great rucksack. I love it, I can't honestly. I don't really take a big gym bag uh, like so. I don't really take one this big anymore unless I have like an early morning session and... Yeah, I have like a shower and all the rest of it, but typically I just shower at home. But that's if I'm like traveling to the gym or going to a different gym and I've got like a different day. For example, I've got to take my weight belt, my weight shoes and things like that for training like deadlifts or squats or whatever. But uh, yeah, I'll check in with you guys in a bit. So. Okay, so I am just getting ready now. Jack is on his way, and now I've got to come back up into my room to get my blimmin' wallet. Gym card in it. I always forget this stuff. Jack is outside. Do you know what? I need to get like one of them gorilla pod things, like the tripod things that you hold, because Jesus, this aches my arm. Jack is here. What are you saying, Boyle? We're here at the gym, we've parked in the school car park. It's, it's just like closer, but uh, Jesus, it's sunny out. But I didn't really want to bring sunglasses because, uh, yeah, we're going to the gym, so it's just over there. I don't know if you can see, just over there. But obviously the gym car park is a lot further away, further away than this one. So you have to like go all the way around the back end of all the park there. So we just park here and we just walk over. But yeah.
this is the first time I've attempted 80 kilos in, well, I haven't done it for about six months. So I'm gonna try and get at least two reps. But we'll see how it goes. on this exercise guys, on the side laterals, I'm bringing my elbow up before the wrist and I'm really pulling through the elbow. Just how Jack is here. You see how his elbows are coming up before his wrists. I see so many people pulling with their wrists and going up like this. It's not really the best way, um, obviously, if you want to keep your, your shoulder joint really mobile and stuff it's doing it the way you're coming up elbow first just really reduces the risk of injury so bear that in mind Yeah. 
done with the workout. Finally, drink up here. Yeah, that was probably the longest workout I've done in a long time. We hit multiple chests, like exercises, multiple shoulder exercises, triceps as well. Uh, now we're just going to go and pop in the, hop in the sauna uh, just to sweat a bit more, just like a little bit of relaxation and like recovery and stuff. Let me just pop you. It's embarrassing when like you're vlogging and people walk past you and shit. You don't even know. But yeah, that was a long workout. I hope you enjoyed it, took something away from it. Get my bottle. Is there a place to fill that up down there? It's important to stay hydrated, so. Right, so, we've got some chicken, which looks quite gross there, because obviously it's raw. But uh, where are the little twang, twangy things at? They're here, aren't they? Right, so. Flip this over a little bit. I've got a bit of pepper seasoning on there. Oh, look at that. A little love art for the game, do you know what I mean? And we've got a bit of pasta on the go as well. Because obviously, just got to carve up a little bit after that session. Feeling very tired. Uh, yeah. Hit my max 95 kg on the bench, which never even thought I'd do. But uh, yeah, I'll check in you guys when this is ready. Right guys, so I've just finished making up the chicken and the pasta. Basically, just fried it up to a nice and golden brown and a bit crispy on the outside. Put it in the oven for about 10, 15 minutes until the pasta was ready, just to dry it out a bit. Yeah, because basically, I don't really like really moist and like wet chicken because obviously they're pumped full of uh, water and stuff, it's best to get your chicken and all your meat from the butchers, but can't afford that, so yeah. I'll eat this, um, I'll just quickly show you, I don't know if I, just, I did just show you, but I've got a bit of uh, mayonnaise on there as well, not too much, just a little uh, squirt on there. I don't want too much because the fat content's quite high and it's something that I don't want to have much of because obviously I would rather prioritise my carbs and protein. Um, I obviously use carbohydrates as an energy source but uh, yeah I'm probably now I don't think we're gonna go golf today because it's just started to rain and obviously it's not really the best I don't typically do that many interesting things in my day-to-day -day life I mean usually on the weekend and things like that um, I kind of like go out and we I go to like nice places and I do like things that are cool and fun and interested in that. But everything costs, just costs so much money nowadays, you know? I'm just about to chow down on this because I'm starving after the gym. I did walk my girlfriend to the bus stop and then on the way back I did pick up a, a uh, Mars protein bar and a zero calorie Y monster, which I'll put on the screen here. I'll put it on the screen here. Uh, like the nutritional content and all the facts and what it is because you've probably never seen a Mars bar protein bar but they are insane I just don't know why I did an Australian accent then it was shit but it is what it is <laughs> Will this get me copyright? <laughs> I better turn that down. Right guys, so basically, we're just on our way back from the city. It's just gone six o'clock and I haven't vlogged since three o'clock. So in the space of your two seconds, it's actually been three hours for me. Anyway, pointless information, Jab. You know what I mean? I don't know. But uh, yeah, sun's in my eyes right now. <laughs> Pretty good. But uh, yeah, so went to JD Sports to get some gym shoes because I'm pretty sick of like going in like vans and stuff like that. Basically just like my normal trainers that I really like and I'm just ruining them at the gym so 
I went to get some uh, normal ones. I think they're called like, I don't know, they, they're like greeny. They're a greeny colour. And it's got like a bubble at the back, so they're like Air Max or Vapor Max or something. They're like 90 quid. But at the end of the day, they're going to be helpful and it's the cheapest that were there. So um, I'll just go this way, Jack. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah, and I've got some socks as well, so I don't know why I'm telling you this, but yeah, I just wanted to know that I'm going to have like a shoe, the same shoe I put on every day instead of putting a different pair of Vans on or like just a really nice pair that I'd rather wear like out, do you know what I mean? So that's why I just went and got some gym shoes. But yeah, I can drive now, so yeah. Yeah, get that camera off me, man. <laughs> Definitely gonna get copyright for that. I better turn that down. But yeah, I hope. You guys are enjoying the vlog. What if I just crashed it? I went, and, I went in the car and boom, it hit me inside. Imagine that. You've been framed, literally. Hundred quid, however, however much it is. I can't speak today, honestly. I actually can't talk. But uh, yeah. You know what, this is probably going to be a super long video, but I will. I hope you're enjoying it. Shoes I got. They're pretty nice, aren't they? Uh, yeah, I'm going to conclude this video. I really hope you've enjoyed it. Please drop a like rating. Like or dislike, don't really care. Uh, yeah, see you later.